Vodka, half liter. 300. Are you ever going to go out with me? Come on, Larissa, please. I'm bad news. All saleswomen are bad news. Any food with that? No, eating after six is bad. That's why I drink. Listen, <laughs> stop hating on men already, huh? Some of us are trying to get home after work. Small oh bills, exact gosh. change if you've got it. What, is it too difficult to count change? What do you mean, sir? I'm just making sure you don't forget how to count. What'll it be? A bag of ravioli. 102. Nothing smaller. Gonna need change. No problem. 25. Out of Towner. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be so late. Katia, oh. hi. Oh, you're still here. For you? Are the sausages fresh? Yeah, came in this morning. Okay, weigh one for me. One hundred and fifty. Oh, that's too much. May I have a little less? Listen, please? can you do it a bit quicker? They drink away their salary and can't buy food, right? Oh, okay. go ahead. You can pay the rest later. Thanks a million. You idiot. Larissa, I'm here. Larissa, darling, I'm so sorry that I'm late. Please forgive me. What? All right, why are you so worried? You asked to leave for an hour, right? How long have you been away? The whole day? Larissa. Oh, that's nothing. Larissa, you know how it is. He just won't let me leave. Legs off. I don't think you tried that hard to get away, am I right? Well, yeah, but you know how sweet he is. And things are sour with the husband. Why would they be? No, the husband's sweet too. Move over. It's different with the husband. If you eat nothing but chocolate all the time, you get sick of it, right? That's why you need a marshmallow once in a while. Hey, do you know what I wonder? Aren't you afraid that it isn't good for you to be eating so many sweets in the first place? Larissa, what are you talking about? You're so silly. Of course you wouldn't understand. You live a totally different life. Me? Right. Mine's completely different. So funny, you know? Too funny for words. I'm so thirsty. The train's here. Enjoy. Yes, ma'am. Can you get me a bottle Hello? of water? Hello? I'll have a bar of chocolate and a bottle of kefir. Documents, please. Show me your documents. Right. Our people Wait, all what? know where the 24 hour drugstore is. We have to find out where you came so. from. Hold on, guys. Hold on. My baby's at home with a fever. I just have to buy some medicine. That's all. Guys, what are you doing? Yeah, tell me about I, your Are you baby. out of your mind? Look, I just went to the drugstore yeah. for a second. I've only got 300 guys, bucks. Guys, guys, what has he done? Why are you staring at me, you pig? Where the hell have you been? Out making a mess again, you miserable alcoholic? Boys, I don't know what he's done this time, but let him go, please. I just can't afford to keep bailing him out of jail anymore. Who are you? Documents. Hold on, I know her. She works for Sir Yoga Tyson. That's he right. yours? He is. What else did you give that kid? Don't you have any conscience at all, you monster? All right, bail the man out. Do whatever you want. What do you mean, What do you buyout? mean? Come on, what is she paying for? Sir, if you keep screaming without documents, you'll have to come with me all right. to verify That's ID. It. Hold on, here. This is all I've got. That's not much for a fine fellow like this. Fellas, are you joking? I've given you everything. I won't have more until payday. All right, fine. Man, you should have gone to the drugstore earlier. Am I right? You have to take whatever medicine you got at home. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, you... You really showed those guys. I actually believed it's that was fine. your husband. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'll give you the money back. Where do you live? 14 Pushkina. All right. Okay. First thing in the morning, then. Oh, I can't do it in the morning. I'll come in the evening. Will you be home at 8.30? Yeah, sure. I'll be home. Go on. Go. You'll pay me back. I believe you. I will, for sure. Yeah, Listen, for sure. where's the 24-hour drugstore, actually? On the square. Ah, thank you. Thank you. I promise I'll pay you back tomorrow. Go already. Hello. Hello. Любой должен быть 
Oh my god, Vitya! Why is the door wide open? Huh? Larissa? Larissa? Where are you? Listen, you better set Vitya straight. What is all this? What is it with his behavior? What is he doing? Look at what's happened to my seed beds. Where are you? Larissa? 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 Larissa, what do you want? Larissa, they've they've uh, they've trampled down they've trampled down all my seed beds. I've been planting uh, for two days straight. Paid a ton of money for the seeds. The carrots are gone now. A whole herd of friends came to hang out with Vitya yesterday. What in the world is this? Come on in. <sighs> there was a girl with them. Mm-hmm. A ponytail. Wow. Like a mare. <laughs> Watch out, or she'll come back here with a foal. Knock on wood. Bite your tongue. Oh, you're playing up to Vidya too much. You've been sparing him all the time, and now what? They've trampled down all the carrots. Yeah, what you need is a man to keep Vidya under control. He doesn't need a man to control him. Wasn't his dad scary enough? Uh, I don't mean scared, respectful. What's the difference anyway? What does it even matter? Oh, my nephew, he came to your shop, he asked about you. Mikhailovna, for God's sake, enough already with the nephew. Well, he's worth something. A retired captain. Uh, honorable discharge from the army because of health issues. He's a strong man. Very capable. Just the kind of man you need to knock some sense into Vidya. Vidya's got plenty of sense. He doesn't get anything below a B in school. Well, think about yourself then. How long have you been hugging a pillow, huh? Huh? And the years have been ticking away. You know. And your fire has been burning low for a long time. What? <laughs> Yeah, soon they'll be just embers and coals. <sighs> you know, I quit these husband-finding experiments a long time ago. Oh. You still owe me for the carrots. How much? <clears throat> Look, that's fine. It won't take more than a thousand, thanks. 
Have you, have you completely lost your mind? Are you nuts? I'd seed the whole veggie garden for a thousand. Well, what about the work I already put in? Take a look! There's not a single good bone in my body. All right, listen, if you want to fight, come by the shop. I don't handle business at home. I don't have it now. I'll pay you back this evening. Listen, aren't you <clears throat> gonna sell your grandfather's house? It's oh, just sitting there, completely empty. Oh, what gosh. a waste. I'd rent it out. At least make a little money off it. Mikhailovna. Huh? I'm keeping that house for Vitya. So he can have a place with his wife. Yeah. Someday. Yeah, right. Who would marry him? Who needs him? Huh? Huh? Just like his alcoholic daddy. Have you finished your tea? Get out. Were you guys hungry yesterday or what? Well, look at him. Hard worker. Come on, Mom. The guys brought the beer. I didn't want it. They got me hammered. I don't even know how it happened. Beer is just awful. It stinks. I promise I won't do it again. I swear. Who's the girl that was here with you? What do you mean? What girl? How would I know? The one with the ponytail? Ah, uh, that's not a girl. That's a boy. That's Yoka. He plays guitar in our band. Do you want an omelet? Yeah. Well, sit down. <sighs> Look at you. Pass me the notebook. So then, your husband found out? No. He went fishing into Petco with him. And you immediately ran to your other guy? Well, yeah. Larissa, you know how jealous he is? He says to me, you're cheating on me with your husband. Who else would I cheat on him with? Listen, isn't your husband afraid to take Petka fishing? He's only five. Right. I keep telling him that, but there's no use. He takes him fishing or to watch football all the time. He never listens to me. Is that a bad thing? I had to pull my husband away from Bitya to save him from another beating. Open up. We won. Jason. Let me in. Oh, hello. Hey there. Why are we closed? It's just for five minutes. Meet the champion. Big guy here smashed everyone. Show him the medal. Dad. Dad what? You're the champion. Cool. Grab a chocolate. Dad I don't want chocolate. Sucks. I want ice cream. Come on, show me something. Anything hello? good? What? Here, the cone. Vitya, where are you? I can't yeah. hear a thing. What happened, Vitya? How about this. What? What happened? Well, they what? got their butts kicked. You should have seen it. They, Vitya. We have to deal with him. Vitya. 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 Why are you taking him? What has he done? There must be a mistake. Vitya. Three people you... have been taken to the hospital. Is that a mistake? Step aside, lady. What are you trying to say? That he did all that by himself? Everyone else got away. He got arrested. Look at him. How could he cripple anyone? He's barely standing on his feet. I'm begging you. Let him go. There's clearly a mistake. He's just the one that got caught. Look how many people are around here. He'll come and fill out an application. We'll let him go if he's not guilty. Yeah, right. And they'll still charge him. Let him go, please. Do you have kids? I'm begging you. You're an unfortunate woman. Your husband's a hound dog. His son's a criminal. He's not a criminal. It was just an accident. I'm begging you. You'll ruin his whole life. Don't do it, please. Close the window. I'll be back soon. I don't have any money. I would have paid, I swear. Come on, I don't need your money. I can't let him go now in public. I'm sorry. We'll just drive him around the corner and then you can pick him up there. Thank you. Thank you. 
What did you drink? I'm asking you, what did you drink? I don't know. The guys made me drink moonshine, I guess. What do you mean made you drink? Did they force it into your stupid mouth? They laughed. They said, you're not a man if you don't drink. And then what? They lost, I drank. Did you prove you were a man? Got drunk and picked a fight, did you? No, I passed out right after I drank. I woke up and they were dragging me somewhere. Well, are you sick? Oh dear, can you walk? Oh my goodness. Why are you just sitting there? Come on, eat. It used to help your father. Maybe you'll feel better too. Oh, Vitya. You're becoming so much like your father. Eat. Hi, it's the hero. Let's go outside. Go to bed as soon as you're done. You hear me? Here's your salary and bonus from Sergei. Great. What about tomorrow? Are you going to work? What else can I do? Why would you? How's Vitya? Oh, don't ask me. Oh, come on, stop it, Larissa. He's just at that age. He'll get past it. Right. Listen, I grew up without a father. Like Vitya. My grandfather raised me. He was the best. Midas touch. A gift from God. Just look. Look at the house he built. He didn't manage to finish that one. He would come down to the construction site. One day there was a landslide when they were filling the foundation, and a slab went down on him. And he decided to hold it alone, do you see? Instead of calling for help, he decided that he would do it himself. Long story short, he was buried there. Larissa, why are you telling me this? Because he always said that I was like him. Just as stubborn, doing everything by myself. And here's what I'm thinking. Could he have been right? My allergies. <clears throat> as soon as everything starts blooming, I'm scratching all over. This is uncomfortable. Allergic to flowers, are you? Yeah, flowers. Thank you. <clears throat> Well, Mr. Nikolovich, shall we drink to our meeting? No, I don't drink. <clears throat> I'll, I'll do it for you. <laughs> when else do I get to taste something from the shop? Why is that? Mm. You mean you don't drink at all? No, not at all. <clears throat> uh, Mr. Nikolovich, some bread? Thank you. Larissa, why don't we move to first name terms and ditch the formalities? I'm not your senior officer, you know? More like the opposite. <laughs> well, why not? Uh, uh, she... she seasons as well as she cans. She's the best in the village. Everything mm -hmm. from her own mm -hmm. garden, by the way. Yes, as soon as the snow melts, she's in the garden. And she doesn't stop until it gets really cold. That's her. Mikolovna, and she... calm down already. You're no better matchmaker than I am an astronaut. Yeah, she's right, Anna. You're certainly not doing things by the book. All right. I'll be quiet. You figure it out, right? Uh, tell me, is this herring? Yes. Lightly salted? Yes. Yes, I'll take some. Well, I very much appreciate the predisposition for household duties in a woman. My ex-wife didn't really want to stay at home with her husband. Hmm? Naturally, you can see where that led. What happened? Well, there was a civilian. A man. <clears throat> well, my wife betrayed me and insisted on division of property, which meant the apartment owned by me. Mm-hmm. And where did you go after that? Well, for the amount I was entitled to have paid to me, under the law, I purchased an apartment in your town, following the advice Anna gave me. I told him immediately, come to us. You know, finding a good wife here is as easy as cleaning your nose. Why aren't you eating? I'm gonna eat, don't worry. I actually was kind of searching for a woman who would spend the second half of my life with me. Mm-hmm. 
at the moment, I feel like I'm close to finding her. Mom, I have to do my homework. Exams are coming up. Well, go if you need to. Larissa, could I have some herring? Pass it over, please. Mm -hmm. The herring, please. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Uh, just watch your step here. Right. Well, this is it. What am I looking at? The property. Here, uh, take a look. Uh, beautiful, isn't it? Well, yes. No, nice uh, household. Take a look. She probably has this one for water here, right? Well, there should be another bird bath here. I wonder what she plants here. Looks like beets. Great. Oh, a real homemaker. Oh, 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 wow, wow. Oh, here, oh, look at this. Look That's at where this. a man's hand oh. is needed. Oh, right here. Here you go. Here, <laughs> uh, this is this is how you do it. Look here, oh, right here. Okay. See, the greenhouse, the, the greenhouse. greenhouse. Oh, Larissa. Uh, oh, uh, how is it going here? Little uh, have by little. the tomatoes sprouted? Uh, have they? Nice. Uh, little by little. Oh, look, here it is. Your grandpa's house. Oh, well. It still stands, but no use, huh? He spent so long on it. Mikolovna, huh? I didn't ask you to be a guide. Well, you certainly can find a proper use for a house like that. Yes, you're right. Sell it, for instance. Uh, what? All right, no selling. Well, okay. It was nice to meet you, Alko. Good luck and uh, see you. All right. Bye. All right, okay, okay. G see goodbye. you later. Goodbye. <laughs> Look, I'm telling you, the host will enter here and the tenants will enter over well, there. What tenants? We'll, we'll make the entrance here and come out right to the water. Oh, Look, hold nice, on. Right? How many meters are there to the water? A hundred meters? I don't know. What well, do you think? We'll take a look. Yeah, we'll take a look. That's not far. Uh, there's another good house. Where? This uh, one, look at it. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh. Well, what did you make of him? Didn't like him at all? What do you think? I don't know. It doesn't seem disgusting. You're gonna marry him just like that? Vitya. <sighs> Come check this out. I just made this. Look at that. It's really good, I'm impressed. Hmm. It's good, but I could do better. The hardware won't allow it. But it's okay. I'll have the money someday and I'll buy this awesome new computer with a better video card. How much does it cost? About 2,000, I think. Why so cheap? Dollars, Mom. Cool though, oh. right? Yeah. It's cool.
we are. Almost there. Hold on. Here we go. All right. Wait a second. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold, oh. Here you go, here you go, careful. Don't get wet. Let me get the door. It's... <clears throat> so this is where you're taking me? Yes. So this is a good cafe. I've done reconnaissance. That place has great prices. The area seems mm. to be good. Well, what's wrong? If you don't want it, then... I don't know why I'm complaining. No one's taking me out in a while, actually, so... Shall we? Uh, yes. No, it's good here. They've got nice kebabs and stuff, salads, and the juice. <laughs> and the juice? Here you yeah. go. Uh-huh. It's fresh Is juice. Is it really fresh? Yes, try it. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Larissa, take a look at that weather, huh? Beautiful. I could go fishing right away. Ah. Well, how much do I owe? All right. Found a spot. One, two. Larissa, you know what I've been thinking? <clears throat> Why would we put it off, huh? Hmm? Meaning? Well, there are conditions for joint living. The house is exemplary. Well, and the adjacent territory is fine. <clears throat> and I generally find you nice. Generally? Larissa, listen. You're a grown woman. You must understand. You're not Marilyn Monroe. Are you serious? Well, it's not like I'm ashamed to be seen with you. You know, marry a beautiful woman. Hmm? You're sure. good. Hello. Enjoy your meal. This is a strategic maneuver, I think. Always expect your enemy to strike. They are watching all the time. Listen, drinking prepackaged tea is the same as breathing through a gas mask. Don't take offense. I certainly like separate parts of your appearance, you know. Do you really? Mm-hmm. Which ones? Turn your head. That way. Here. I like that you wear your hair braided. Women with short hair, on the other hand, are a total, complete turnoff. Why is that? They look like officers. Would, would you like anything? The kebab is delicious. Look, please don't. Don't All do right. this, please. What's wrong? I'm begging you, don't do it. Come on, Larissa. Don't do this. I'm begging you, stop. What's wrong? What is it? Haven't had a man for a while, right? Are you are worried? You nuts? Nervous? Why are you hesitating? You like me. You can rely on me, that's for sure. Come on. All now. right, listen carefully. I know that I'm not Marilyn Monroe. <sighs> I'm not claiming I am. But I've been doing just fine on my own. With no support. I somehow managed to stand firmly on the ground without help. But Vitya needs support. I understand that. I'm not a fool. We'll talk as soon as you find common ground with him. Understand? Yeah, that's not to understand. And I thought... Uh, <clears throat> don't worry, okay? Yeah. I'll set your Vitya straight. Do you know how many loons like him I've cut off at the knees? <clears throat> I'll do the same to yours. <clears throat> You'll see. Take me home. The rain soaked all the wood. Is that... Yeah. Everything's clear. Hold it. Oh, looks like we're gonna need new rafters. Right? Vitch, you follow me. What are you waiting for?
You see? It's very simple. Go ahead. You know who's got the right social structure? Who? The wolves. Everyone has his own task in the pack. If you do your tasks nicely and properly, you get a large piece right after the hunt. Otherwise, you have to stay hungry. Do you see? I see. But what if I don't want to, to be in the pack? So what do you think, you're the smartest? Well, probably not the smartest. Come on, saw. Press harder, let's go. Ah, let me look. Ah. Look, come here. I'm coming. Look. You take it, you press it, and yeah, here. You see, it goes further by itself. Come on. Here. Hop up. Come on. The main thing to keep in mind is that your hands and your head are attached to your shoulders. Mr. Nikolovich, I have yeah. a feeling that these raptors are not going to be enough. Guess we'll have to change the whole structure. Look how clever you are. Huh. Listen, if you act dumb, I'll... I'll have to impose a penalty on you straight away. You won't be able to sit after that. Do you understand? I do. Good. Okay, 20 minutes for lunch. Go ahead. That's what I meant, Mr. Nikolovich. Ah, damn it. The wood broke. It would have been fine if it wasn't raining. Yeah, that's fine. You can redo it tomorrow. On the bright side, you'll have more time to work together, right? Well, yeah. There's a lot of work to do. Okay, then. All right. Bye. See you. Thank you. See you. Why are you so gloomy? says she's clever about some things, but a fool about others. Shh, don't let down. She says she won't let anyone in this house. That's it. You're the only hope, Oleg. Mikhailovna. I remember the pact. What's wrong? Well, why are you walking in circles around because her for her so son. long? Little smartass. As soon as I marry her, the house is yours. She thinks you've got an apartment? So what? Let her think that. <clears throat> ah. Why don't we take... Another hundred of the berries, and and then I'll go. This is why they kicked you out of the army. Oh, uh, don't. don't. What's that? Shh. You smartass. Mom.
forbid you. Come here, let's talk. Like two grown men. God damn it. I'm sick of wearing sunglasses. He deliberately decided to come home early from fishing. Just to check on me. God, how can you stand this? What else can I do, Larissa? He hits me because he loves me. Love can be a really complex thing sometimes. Oh, where's the love in that? Love is when a boy walks a girl home from school and his heart beats so fast that it's hard to breathe. That's love. And everything else after that is just life. They call anything love here. Larissa, hold on. Are you gonna marry him? This retired captain? <sighs> Are you out of your mind? You said you didn't like him, that he was a drag. You should get married for love, Larissa. Is that right? Are you a relationship expert? Goodbye. Larissa? Larissa! Why are you here? Your Vidya has pulled another trick. What? He got to the bottle I've been saving for the holiday. What in the world are you talking about? Good thing Oleg dropped by, walked him home, and put him to sleep. He's right. You have to be strict with Vitya. <sighs> He's lying. He's lying that he doesn't drink. This is all because of the house. Well, well, here it is. Here it is. This is what I said. Get out. Get out now. Mom, Let's go. don't you believe me? Quickly. I'll make a soldier out of you. One. Two, come on, keep them straight. Quit messing around. Keep your legs straight. You'll know what it is to lie to your mother and get on her nerves, huh? I didn't lie to her. One. You made me drink. Two, one. I told you, she'll trust me. Don't get in the way or it'll be worse for you. <clears throat> one, one, two, one, two. Screw you. What? Come here, come here. I said you. Get over here, come here. I told you. Screw come you. Here. I told you, drop and give me 20 right now. You're gonna get down and do push-ups. One, one, What are you doing, two. you monster? What the hell are you doing? Disciplinary measures, come on, push up. Touch him again and I'll kill you. Do you understand? Are you out of your get mind? Get out of here. What's wrong with Go you? Go away, you What's pig. wrong with you? Get lost. Okay, I'll leave. I'll leave, but you'll call me What are you later. looking at? You'll see, you'll, you'll get call yours now, me. with the timber in your head. I'm fed up. What am I supposed to do with you knuckleheads? Come here. What are you doing? Come back here right now, Vitya. Go, go to your room right now. Hello. What? Your gate was wide open, so. What are you doing here? What do you need? Ah, oh, you brought the money, I'll take it. Uh, I guess I picked the wrong time, I'm sorry. Well, give me the money and go already. I'm not done with you. Look, I can't give you the money now. I had the money before, but now I don't. Why did you come then? They, uh, they threw me out of my apartment without notice, and you're the only person that I know in this town. I only really need one night. I'll find something else tomorrow. What is the matter with you? You think you can come to me every time you need help? You're shameless. Get out of here. Before I make you leave, everyone here is losing it. Vitya, what are you doing in there? Mom, I promise you, that wasn't what you think it was. I haven't decided what to think yet. Oh, come on, Mom. Okay. We'll talk about it tomorrow. Not now. Go to sleep. so mean. Do you want something to drink? No, I don't. And you don't want to drink either. All right, you sleep, okay? 
lean on me like that slowly and fall asleep. Everything will be fine, okay? I promise. Do you hear me? Vitka? Hmm. It's your name, but does everyone call you Vitka? Well, I don't know. Kind of. Alright. Then you can call me Alka. How about you call me Vitya? Alright. Are these real fishes? They look like the real ones. That's because they're 3D. Here, look. Mm-hmm. Is this monster evil? No, he's nice. He just looks scary. Vitya, why are you bugging our guests with your pictures? Come on, let's have breakfast. Good morning. Morning. Can we please call my dad now? <coughs> Do you need anything else? No, everything's fine, thank you. My name is Maxime. Larissa. Larissa, I have one more request. My last one. The last one, really? Hard to believe, actually. What? Nothing. Do you mind if Alia stays here until the evening? I'll try to find an apartment by then. Tea or coffee? Tea, I guess. Dad, can you believe this? There's ice, a big piece of ice, and it's not melting. Vitya, what is it called again? Cold cellar. The ice won't melt until the end of summer. Isn't that great, Dad? Can we stay until the end of the summer? Looks like we're short a few chairs. Well, what do you think, Larissa? Can Alia stay until the evening? All right, but why only until the evening? What difference does it make where you rent? You can stay here. I won't charge you very much. Yay, we're staying. <laughs> thank you. I don't know how I can thank you enough. It's all right. Dad, look at this crown Vitya made for me. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> You've got quite a strict mother, Vitya. Are you serious? With a log? What if you hadn't missed? If I hadn't missed, I would have caught him and hit him a couple times more. <laughs> He'll be hiding from you now. Hey, so this new tenant, what's he like? Is that all that you think about? I only took them in because of the girl, understand? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right, for the girl. He's good looking, that's it. Hey, he's not good looking. Oh, you don't say. He's not interesting, mm -hmm. I'm telling you, he's unpleasant. He's got a very difficult character. Men like him only care about their kids, especially if it's a girl. They don't treat others like people. Larissa, how do you manage to get all that? Doesn't take much, it's all in his face. All right, Larissa, what is this? Come on, Katya, get out of the way. What is this right here? These are my work records, so I don't forget. Ah, yeah, I see, I see. All right. Galka from the kindergarten, 300 rubles. Uncle Lisha, 500 rubles. Babalera. Well, what's this commentator's column here, huh? Why are you so nervous? Have we ever been short anything? You're right, never. Based on this, I take you for a fool, Larissa. Huh, why are you looking away? Have I said something wrong? It can't be that everyone pays debts on time. When you let them go on credit, you're using your own money, aren't you? That's my business, isn't it? Sure it is. But I'm gonna tell you something. Enough with this charity in my shop, all right? 
Say something. Well? Well what? Do you want me to lie to you? Come on. <sighs> Larissa, you're a good woman. But life, it hasn't taught you anything, has it? Are there more? Give them here. You tell me. Would you like? Well, not an officer's haircut, of course, but something shorter. <laughs> All right, Vidya, let's go for a Get walk. Away. Come on, come on, let's go. Hey, give her the doll back. <laughs> give the doll back. <laughs> Vidya! Hold on! Hold on! What are you doing? Hang, Do you hang see on, what's just let him deal with it himself. <laughs> I said get out of here! Oh, out! Vidya, what's wrong with you? Get lost! Get out! What don't you understand? <laughs> right, you've gotten totally nuts. Go away! Uh, hey. Are you alright? Mm -hmm. Here. Did you see that? Huh, nicely done. Dad! Dad! Oh, <sighs> hey there. Well, hero, we can't live without hero. adventures, he can saved we? Me. Did he now? He did. Well, nicely a done. Hero. Did you get a haircut? Just a trim. You look good, right, Daddy? Thank you. What are we doing out here? Let's go inside. Oh, the shovel. Come on. Let's go. I would have never expected that. Nicely done, really. Hey, you. you acted like a real man. Morning. I was just walking to the bus. Good morning. Hello. Are you going to work? Yes. Well, why don't we go together? We'll take different routes. And stop stalking me. I have to go. Don't hurt yourself. Mm -hmm. To knock at. To pull, knock pull, 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 on. Pull. To know about. To know on. It's to know of. And how would you even know it's right? Make a loop now? I don't know. I just memorized it. 
All right, I'm going home. Hold on, we'll have some tea. Vitya will walk you, right, Vitya? Of course. Good evening. Daddy's home. Hey, Button. Hello. Isn't it late for you? Hey, you. I decorated your old wallet. <laughs> it looks so Did pretty. You? Oh, wow. What a beauty. Did you I do it know. yourself? No. Aunt Larissa taught me. You came right on time. We were going to drink tea. Drink tea? Great. What about pie? What tea? It's already late. We have to get up early tomorrow. Oh, all right. We'll have tea another time. Let's Goodbye. go. Goodbye. You forgot Golubina. <sighs> Good night. Goodbye. I can't believe him. Mom, what's wrong? Nothing. Hey, miss, is this barbecue fresh? I haven't been a miss since before you were in diapers. What do I call you then, ma'am? That works. Your food, monsieur. Thank you. Let's go to the train. Hello? Hello. Do you need any help, or do you know what you want? I know what I want. Those chocolates there, uh, the ones in the red box, are they good? I suppose. I see. They look nice, I On guess. the outside, a lot of things look nice. But the inside can be something else. You never really know. It could be anything. You have to try it, or you won't ever know. I stopped trying things a long time ago. 155. Mm-hmm. The usual for you? Mm, hello. hello. How's the construction? Construction's fine, thanks. Thank you. See you. Is Sergey coming in today? Mm, no, I don't think so. What were you chatting about? He's an interesting man. He's a foreman. My neighbor bought a flat and invited me to the site to see the construction. <clears throat> you see, he's all about business. He does everything properly, you know? He's a very interesting guy. What did he buy? What do you think? Vodka. Ah, uh, I see. Lady, how long do I have to wait? Ma'am? I'm coming. What's going on? It smells like pancakes. Someone's got a day uh -huh, off? Uh-huh, and a bonus. We'll have a party. We'll see. Vitya, we need to repair the barn. It's about to fall to pieces. I'll fix it, sure. I'll do it when I come home from school. Why don't we ask Maxime to help? No, I'll help you with it. We can do it ourselves. That's all right. We can handle it. All right. Okay. And we're going to buy you a computer. You're doing a great job with those seeds. Who taught you? Your mom? No, my Aunt Nadia did. I don't remember my mom. Mmm, your Aunt Nadia did. I see. What's with your ear? It's just a compress. I forgot to take it off. I had an earache yesterday. Dad made me a vodka compress. Mmm, <laughs> I see. Well, your dad is nice. He knows how to use vodka properly. Yes, he knows everything. It's good that we live together now. We used to live with Aunt Nadia before. The three of us in a big city, not like this one. Mm, right, the three of you. But then, Daddy came here to work, and I missed him. I used to cry all the time. Mm hmm And he missed me too. And then, he took me with him, and we came here. Mm hmm and you got sick when you came, didn't you? Come on, move down. You got sick, didn't you? Yes, I did. And then Dad even had to give up his job for some time. But then I got well, and Dad ran out of money, and they threw us out of the apartment, but it's pretty good. Oh, yeah? 
And why is that good? It's good because we met you. I see. Oh, do you hear that? Betia's already working. I wonder how he managed to walk past us. Let's go see. Hey, what are you doing over there? Fixing the roof. We had a half day at work because of the holiday. Who asked you to do that? Oh, I don't need to be asked. Someone has to fix the roof, you know? This is my roof and my barn, and these are my problems, and I'll solve them myself without strangers. And stop taking other people's things without asking. <sighs> okay. Alia, let's go. Daddy, what are we gonna do now? Mom, do you know where Ali is? The door is locked. No, I don't know. She went somewhere with her dad. Okay. I guess there's no barbecue tonight. What barbecue? Maxime said we were gonna have a barbecue today. What is it with you? Maxim this, Maxim that? Haven't you ever had barbecue before in your life? Go on, make yourself useful. Well, are they coming for dinner? They're not. They're leaving. What do you mean, leaving? Where? Maxime told Alia to pack her things. She's sitting there crying. She doesn't want to go. What? I don't want them to leave either. Can you explain to me what's going on? Why are we leaving again? Oh, Alia. Keep quiet. Maxime. This is for the month. Alia, let's go. Hey. Hey, listen. Please don't go. Please forgive me. God knows what I've said to you. Believe me, I feel so ashamed now. Forgive me, please. Please. Alia, run to Vitya. Yay, Vitya! Yay! What do you hate so much about me? What have I done to you? Tell me. Well, I don't know, really. Right, but there has to be some kind of reason, doesn't there? I met Vitya's father when I was still in the ninth grade. He came from another school. You know, when I saw him, I thought, God, he's so handsome. I was stunned and my mouth just fell open. And so I spent two years at the same desk, looking at him with my mouth open. Then I waited for him to come back from the army. And then when he did come back, I got the full range of family life. I had everything. He'd drink, womanize, and beat me, and Vitya. And then he finally ran away with a girl. It doesn't matter. He took all the money I'd been saving for repairs. Then, after him, there was someone else in my life. He was even worse. Believe it or not, he was worse. When I sent him away, I was so deeply depressed and I thought, well, I can take the abuse. I can take the abuse and the sadness. But I can't do it to Vitya. I can't let it happen to him. Then, after all that, I spent eight years hugging a pillow. I used to work whole days through dusk to dawn to keep busy and not think about anything. And then I met the retired captain. You know, I wouldn't have even looked at him. No. But Vitya is at such a difficult age, and I got so scared. Somehow I thought he was heading down a slippery slope, and... Well, you know, he doesn't have a male role model, and I just... I hadn't noticed that. 
It seems I had it all wrong. I was looking for a stepfather, and it seems he needed a little sister. Well, a stepfather wouldn't harm the boy either. I know. Well, you know, I look at you, and it hurts. I don't know why. It just feels like all of this is your fault, Maxime. What is? Everything. Everything I got from these stupid men. You're the one to blame. Do you see? I don't know why. Yeah, I see. What do you see? I haven't done anything in particular. I know. <laughs> you just don't like me. It happens. <sighs> you know, when... When, uh... When Alia's mother was gone... A lot of women wanted me to like them. I even tried to live with someone. But it was all wrong. After my wife. This was the first time I wanted someone to like me. <laughs> and I failed. <laughs> but I understand. I understand. It's all right. I, I'll try not to bother you anymore. If you don't throw us out, We'll live here until the autumn, and uh, I'll send... I'll send... Ollie, it's Nadia. And I can live by myself, in a hostel. Hold on. But why? Why do you need to send Ollie away? Well, she's going to school soon, so someone will have to do homework with her. Take care of her if she's sick. I won't be able to manage it. Larissa, could you tolerate us? Until the autumn? Yes. At least we've agreed on something. You're my little helper. The knife is sharp, so be careful. Better take the cucumbers outside, will you? Here. Go on. When did you say that? I didn't hear you. You should speak louder, I guess. Well, I said it, but you're as stubborn as a ram. Who's a ram? I'm as stubborn as a ram? Yeah. Oh, I get it, so I'm a ram. Well, no. Am I a ram? Oh, who's a ram? I'm asking you, huh? Who's a ram? Huh? <laughs> Come here. Here we go. Come on. Who's a ram now? Tell me. Tell me who's a ram. You're a ram. Right. Come here. I'm telling you. Come here, I said. <laughs> I gotcha. Uh, who's a ram, huh? I'm a ram? I'm a ram? Yay! Gotcha. Gotcha. Who's one locking horns with everyone? You or Dog me? Dog pile. Who can't stop? Dog pile. <laughs> Another lamb came. Dog pile. Here we go. Dog pile. <laughs> Dog pile, let's go. <laughs> oh, you guys are heavy. Good morning. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. Uh, do you need a hand? No, thank you. Ah, right. Now you have someone to help you. He, he, he fixed the barn, I see. Uh, are you going... are you going to get married now? What? Ah, that's right. Don't rush in. Who knows what kind of man he is? No, sure. He's good-looking. But he's unfamiliar. Strange. A man from somewhere else, huh? Uh, but watch out, because he'll rob you and leave you like Vitya's father did. Get out! Uh, watch out! Watch out! You'll be sorry! You'll be sorry you didn't listen to me! I said all get right, lost! Alright, alright, this strange fellow you'll see soon enough! Yeah! Uh, oh, you passed! Oh.
Now tell me, why does a camel need his humps? I'm Vidya not Hush. saying anything. No. You don't know Yay! why a camel needs his Hello. Oh. Hello. Okay, is everything okay? Of course. Why are you back so late? It was getting really dark out and there was still no sign of you. I was getting nervous. Go get changed. Are you tired? Go on in. Well, I don't have slippers for you. You can keep your shoes on, that's fine. Come on. We were riding boats at the pond. Wow. We saw lily pads. Oh, really? The real lily pads? I wanted to touch them, but Vitya didn't let me. Mm. He was afraid that I would fall in. Mm. You make tea like my mom did. No one else does it like that. But you said you don't remember your mom at all. I don't, but I remember how she made tea. I think I like to watch my mom making tea. You are so sweet. Well, there's not enough memory. It's not gonna work. That's enough. How do you know if there's enough memory? Which one of us has a technical degree, you or me? Let's say it's you, so what? Mm -hmm. Did it really work? Meh. <laughs> Who's the ram? It'll finish uploading. Too much. <sighs> Too little. <sighs> Too much. My good man, take these 10 grams as a gift from me to celebrate love and respect. Would you like a goodbye kiss as a bonus? <laughs> no thanks. Attention esteemed <laughs> customers, please leave the shop immediately. There's a fire, go on, get out. <laughs> Larissa, come on out with it. You're in love. 
Leave me alone. Larissa, don't make me nervous, Larissa! <laughs> Leave me alone, I'm begging Tell you. Tell me right now. Or I'll guess it is... Is it your tenant? Right? Mm -hmm. What did I tell you? And you kept saying he was unpleasant. You saw him. He came here. Katya, this tall, handsome foreman. You and your neighbor went to his construction site. My goodness, for real. All right, Larissa, how was it? Are you crazy? No, Larissa, you have to tell me. It's mandatory to <laughs> keep the flame burning. What? You know, a woman always has to share anything that makes her soul burn to keep the oxygen flowing. It's like a candle. It goes out if you suffocate it because there's no oxygen. You got A's in physics, didn't of you? Of course. Do you know how much the physics teacher loved me? Never mind. Go on, tell me all about it. What happened? <sighs> Katya, you see, I've never had anything like this in my life. At all. I... I was so nervous. And I was afraid that he wouldn't like it, like a silly teenager. Mm -hmm. And he's amazing. He's just this incredible man. I thought they stopped making men like him. There's this aura of reliability around him, you know? And everything that happened between us is going in circles and circles in my head like a movie. I don't understand a thing. I can't think about anything else. Oh, Ooh. Larissa. <laughs> you didn't just fall in love. This is stronger and more dangerous. Why is it more dangerous? Well, because it'll be harder to deal with if it ends. It won't end for me. This is good, isn't it? So good. Well done running? Done. Yeah. Listen, can Alia stay with you for a couple of days? They're sending me on a work trip to Moscow. When? Tomorrow. Mm. I'm taking the morning train. We'll set up a place on the terrace. It's funny there, mice run around. <gasps> mice? <laughs> oh, did he scare you? Don't worry, he's joking. Come did on. you really believe that? Maxime, let's go play football. Aren't you cold? All right, uh -huh. let's go. Let All me right. see. Huh. Oh, watch out. I'm going to pass it to you. You know, it's probably good that you're leaving. It'll be much easier to tell the kids about us for me without you here. You know, I really don't think we need to hurry. We can, um, we can tell them when I come back together. <laughs> what do you want me to bring you from Moscow? I don't need hmm? anything. Okay. No, but I do. <laughs> Wait, I nearly forgot. <laughs> It's Vitya's birthday soon. I have to buy him a present. I'm not sure whether it will be enough or not, but I saved some and borrowed some from Katya. What's the present? A computer. Well, a good one. I, I don't know a thing about it, but you do. Well, I'll pitch in if I need to so we can get him a better one. He's a smart guy. He needs it. I finally realized why I hated you so much. Why is that? Well, because I didn't meet you sooner. <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> we'll be late. Stop. <laughs> when are you coming back? It's okay. We're going to be late. Hold on. Tomorrow in the evening. Mm -hmm. Hey, guys, watch it. You could have pushed Ooh. us off the platform. It's okay. Don't All mess right. with them. Okay. Don't provoke okay. them. Okay. Bye. Mm -hmm. Bye. I miss you. Okay. I'll call you every 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Bye now. Be careful. Step back, step back. Bye. Oh, okay. Down, will you? Don't shout, please. I'm coming. People are waiting, you know.
My sweetie, everything will be fine. I hope. Where's your help? I'll only be here a minute. What's the matter? I'm looking for a foreman. Maxim Petrov? Uh, I wish I knew where he is. If he doesn't show up today or tomorrow, I'm submitting for an investigation. What, already? But hold on, why the investigation? Because he left with the money. He was supposed to give it to the suppliers. Was it a lot? Quite a lot. They paid a part of it in cash, idiots. You, come here. What the hell is this? They promised to take it away two days ago. It doesn't just depend on me. Let's go have lunch, and then when we come back, we can finish this. All right, then. Are you all right? I'm fine. Sorry. Larissa, come to our cottage for the weekend. Why not? We'll go swimming. My man will smoke some fish. Larissa, why are you acting like a Hello. zombie? Hello, I'm coming. He wouldn't have left his child, would he? Uh, sorry, I'm looking for Larissa. That's me. Hi. I'm Nadia, Maxime's sister. Hello. I'm telling you, I don't know where he is. He called and asked me to take Alia. He said he'd come as soon as he could. I got it. Did he ask you to give me anything? No, nothing. He just told me where to find you and that's it. Believe me, if I knew anything else, I'd tell you, but that's it. Hmm? Well, baby, let's say goodbye. My little girl. This is for you. No, stop it. No, it's for you. Thank you. Mm. Well, off we go, or we'll be late. Goodbye. Mom, I'll them, goodbye, okay? Aunt Marisa. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. A con man, that was for sure, yes. <laughs> he, he must have given you a big song and dance. Mm. Mm. What's even worse, he used the girl to get into your heart. Mm. And you've been listening wide-eyed to him. Oh. We women, we don't need much. I used to be the same. My Oleg, on the other hand, he's no wordsmith. But he's right here, he's near. And where's your fancy man? <laughs> Wasting money, is he? Oh. Oh. Oleg. He won't stop with the Larissa, Larissa. I feel sorry for him. He's all alone. Hey, aren't you going to eat the apple? <laughs> oh, well, I'm going to taste it then. Uh, uh, oh. <coughs> oh. So sour. Oh.
Are these my favorites with apples? Why did you make so many, Mom? I couldn't finish them in a week. Oh, shoot. I'm expecting guests. I could be a conditional comfort and support. You can count on me. Hello. Oh, hi, Vidya. Will you eat with us? Thank you, I'm not hungry. What's up with you? Let's have dinner. Vidya, hold on, Vidya. Well. Well, I hope you understand, Larissa, that in return, I would like to get a sensible, so to say, proof of your um, loyalty. Still here. He hasn't no, heard no, a thing. No, no don't. You need to stop. No, 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 no. Stop. I stop don't think making you should a fuss. Here. Just go. It's stop time making a go. fuss. I'm not making a fuss. Don't What's talk wrong to with me. you? Stop it. Take your hands off me. Come on. I said stop it. I'm not making a fuss. Don't talk to me hush, like that. Hush, come stop on. Stop it. Don't touch hush, me. Drop. Hush. Stop it. What, do you, uh, what is that? I Why do you have this in your code? Why do you hush. have this? Stop it. Get off of me. Get off. Stop it. Let go of me. Stop it. Stop it. I'll kill you. You're crazy. I swear I'll hit you in the head. I'm out of here. Get away from me! Get out I'm of the leaving. house! I'm gonna call the police! Vidya! Vidya, where are you? Vidya! Larissa. So what is it? Did you find something out? Of course I did. I promised you I would, so I did it. I gotta tell you, the conversation was difficult. The cops don't know everything yet. I really had to pull some strings. Let's get to it then. All right, listen. <clears throat> Your Prince of Denmark got unlucky on the train. Some passenger wound up some border guards and... They were already feeling tested. In short, they kicked his ass. Although, your guy hit him back, can you imagine? Then the public joined in. They said it was a hell of a fight. Sorry. Anyway, at some point, your guy, two other people got taken away 
In the ambulance in bad shape. Yeah. Unfortunately, without documents and unconscious. And without money. Probably, but I don't know. But two weeks later, he regained consciousness and called his sister. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Larissa, but no one knows why he didn't call you. No, I know why. He was ashamed that he lost the money. I told him what happened with my ex-husband. Come on, listen. Leave all your drama for yourself. That's a soap opera, for God's sakes. All right, let's get back to the investigation. What were you saying? The phones are blocked? His and his daughter's? All mm. right. You know his sister's address? Mm-mm. Damn it. Well, that's it then. Having a last name like that in our country is the same as having no name at all. The boys promised me they'd find him, but I don't know. I understand. Thank you. By the way, the cops have a description of the passenger who started all of it. Oh, I know him very well. What's that? It's a soap opera. Puh. Here we go. <laughs> Put me down. <laughs> do you like it? Look, we can see the house it out from just here. For you. I think it's pretty good. How do you know if there's enough memory? I think it'll work really well. You can trust me. I have a technical degree. So. I wouldn't lie to you, kid. No, I promise. Who wants ice cream? It. Strawberry ice cream really for well. dessert?